Plus chocolate, chocolate, and more chocolate. LA's sweetest dessert fest is back. Our friends from Indulge LA join us live in studio with a taste. Mm. Still ahead, got a sweet tooth, and get ready for the best event of the year. Cheers, our friends from Indulge LA's chocolate show. Join us live in studio with a taste. Mm. <laughs> It is the party of the year for dessert lovers. The seventh annual Indulge Los Angeles is back for the holiday season. The LA Chocolate Festival and Pastry Show is complete with celebrity chefs and some unique sweet treats. Event organizer Alan Sempsar and chef Olivier Roussel are here with a taste of some of this delicious stuff. Welcome, guys. Hey, there's nothing like starting uh, Christmas Eve That's with a right. glass of Cheers. champagne. Cheers, Cheers to, to that. Merry Cheers. Christmas and to you. You know, what I love about this event is that this is for a good cause. It is. So the event is all for St. Baldrick. And the LA Chocolate Festival and Pastry Show is in its seventh year, and it's presented by our friends JetBlue. And one of my favorite parts about this event is if you've never been on JetBlue's first class, which is called Mint, you walk in as a VIP, you walk into their Mint Lounge, and it's the Blue Lounge. So you get to experience what it's all about to be a VIP or being a first class on JetBlue Airline. And then you get treated to all kinds of our favorite champagnes, which is Moreno Champagne. Then we move over to a brand new product. It's uh, huh. called Tetra Tea. Tetra Tea. And it's, it's a brand new line of spirits. And I've made a Moscow Mule if you want to give that a shot. I love Moscow Mules. I'm going to put, the, I'm gonna put the champagne down. I'd rather do the Moscow Mule because I just bought actually these copper cups. Uh, because I love them so much. And it's there. You got to drink the Moscow Mule out of a copper cup. I think it makes it all together. Oh, that's delicious. And of course, we brought together the best chefs from all around the world. And one of our favorites is actually based here, right in Los Angeles, at the Lux Hotel. Uh, Chef Olivier Roussel is with us. All Hello, right. how are you? I'm, I, so show us some of these uh, delicious things you yeah, have. Yeah, so great. Um, at the Lux Hotel, uh, Sunset and Rodeo property, we we're really excited about food, but especially excited about chocolate. So when we Who were approached... <laughs> you get a point. Uh, when we were approached about this, we really went all out and we used like the best ingredients. We have a farm-to-table approach to food. And uh, when it comes to chocolate, we get the best. Some imported, some local. But uh, so I can... We can you go even told me this, this dessert right over here, there is actual real gold flakes on this, and people can eat this? Of course, it's uh, edible. Edible gold, it just makes it uh, very beautiful. Uh, the, the, it's a very simple tart, so not too much um, uh, bells and whistles on it, except the gold. Wow. <laughs> but the chocolate itself is the, is the star of the show, and uh, it's a really high-end chocolate, uh, high cocoa content, very rich. And so you don't need a lot of uh, things to decorate, just a little bit of gold and okay. that's it. Okay, and you're also, and what are some of these things over here? So that's uh, the chocolate Napoleon. It's actually uh, an organic uh, chocolate mousse. Mm. So it's, uh, it's very good, it's very intense in flavor. You know, chocolate, is, it's like wine. There's a lot of uh, different uh, things that goes on when you eat chocolate. You can actually taste a, a lot of different uh, uh, fla flavor, flavor profile. And I was going to ask, that's also something that you're doing at this event. You're pairing chocolates with different alcoholic beverages. Exactly. That's interesting to me. Absolutely. So you get to not only experience the best chocolates, the best pastries, and we got savory foods. So you get a little champagne, a little glass of wine, and you get to pair it with some of your most favorite dishes from famous chefs. Okay. But the best part of being here, you know, the, the lights in the studio are warming up the chocolate. The smell is just amazing. Oh, I bet. So I There's wish we had smell like vision at scent. home. I know, right? If people at home could smell this, it smells incredible, like a chocolate yeah. factory. Um, and, you know, it's interesting to see that you could do so much with chocolate, not just, you know, making it uh, with the... Uh, you know, some of these uh, containers here, but you also mm -hmm. have little lollipops. Little lollipops, yeah, little chocolate lollipops. These are very popular. Uh, we've been featuring them at the, the Beverly Hills uh, Centennial event that uh, the Lux Hotel Rodeo Drive uh, participated in uh, uh, last year. They and almost look too pretty to eat. You can frame them, but <laughs> I suggest you eat them first. Okay. <laughs> Good idea. And then what is this? We've got, like, it looks kind of green, but is that yeah, chocolate? Yeah, it's actually a kiwi, uh, kiwi and uh, chocolate um, uh, Interesting. coolie. So we make it with, uh, with huh. you know, seasonal uh, uh, produce and, uh, and fruits okay. and a uh, really high-end brand of chocolate also. What is your favorite thing that you guys make each year? Mm -hmm. Well, we, at the Lux Hotel on Christmas especially, we have a big uh, dinner and uh, we do Yule Logs, Bûche de Noël. Yule Logs. Being French. I was going to uh, say, that's from France. Exactly. Exactly. That's a big deal there. So I, I don't buy them out. I intend to make it myself. I lock myself in the kitchen. I make these beautiful uh, bûches de Noël, and people appreciate them. How long does it them. take to make those? 
It takes a few hours, a few for sure, hours. but it's, it's really wow. it's a passion to work chocolate and uh, those, those smells, and uh, it's just a passion to us. Well, it is clear that both of you just must love what you do. I mean, how many people can actually work with chocolate day in and day out and make so many delicious things? Thank you both so much for coming in, and uh, good luck with your event. And okay. another reminder, the Indulge Los Angeles 2015 also benefits St. Jude's Children's Hospital. Uh, it is this Sunday, December 27th. Uh, at the uh, Olympic Collection. It starts at 1 p.m. And for more information, of course, you can go to our website, kkl9.com, and click Seen on TV. Again, gentlemen, cheers. Thank you for coming in. This was fun. I'm going to eat Thank some you. of this chocolate in just a minute. Absolutely. Of course, my producer is going to be coming in very shortly, so i got to make sure I beat them to it. <laughs>